there wasn't much due. Um, you know, it was a lot drier than we probably presumed. Um, yeah, I couldn't really put put it down to due. I felt we, we were able to grip the ball quite nicely, and it was not wet. You've got to get them out. You know, that's the only way to stem the flow runs. You know, they're two quality players, world class players at that. You know, and the only way to start them from scoring is by getting them out. You know, I think we probably erred on the on the side of boundaries more often than not. Um, is a way of just probably building a little bit, a little bit more pressure. Uh, up front, we, we went looking for wickets, obviously, because we felt that that was the only way to win the game. Um, we were able to get Shikha down quite early, but at the end of the day, you know, Coley and, and Ruit obviously played outstanding innings. But, you know, I said to the guys, it's, it's no point us coming out looking to contain. Uh, I felt at halfway stage we had a par score, uh, probably 30, 40 runs short. So we felt that we had to get some wickets with the new ball and try to get into the middle order as quickly as possible. Uh, it didn't work out today. And, you know, hopefully in the next game, you know, we can try to get into them with it all a little quicker. I think it was outstanding, you know. Good to see him, you know, get back into to his form. You know, obviously he had a lean patch in the Test Series, you know, some pretty innocuous dismisses as well. So it's good to see him knuckle down and, you know, get a score on the board. And, you know, he's been doing pretty well in the, the limited overs format for us. So it's really good to see him, you know, put in his hand and, and score 100 today, you know. Probably unfortunate at the stage he got out. You know, I felt as though he could have gone a bit deeper, probably, you know, take us a little further into the, in, into the innings. You know, but, you know, still credit to the young player coming in and scoring his third um, ODA century. After, you know, that failure in the test team, so did, is there anything particularly set up in coming into the ODA space where he sort of had to switch between the I think the message I said, uh, was well, sent to the group, you know, just to express yourselves. You know, we've, we've got a player a little bit fearless. Um, we've got so much to gain. You know, we, obviously with a young side, we've got so much to gain. It's just a matter for the guys to go and express themselves. You know, I wasn't too disheartened by the performance today. Yes, you know, um, the game was taken away from us by Coley and, and Roy, but at the end of the day, I felt we were in the game, you know, for most of it. Um, it's just a matter of having the... It's just a matter of, you know, <laughs> it's just a matter for, for us, you know, just to, you know, learn as quickly as we possibly can. You know, hopefully we, you know, we can get into the middle or a little better. Look, I, I prefer to just focus on the guys that we have here. There's no point, you know, us to trying to dwell on who's, who's here and who's not here. I think we just got to focus on who's here. As I said before, I was, you know, not too disheartened by the performance. I thought the batters, you know, really put up their hands in this innings, you know, probably on this on this trap, probably 20, 30 runs short. You know, hopefully we can correct that in the next game and hopefully go a little deeper, especially guys that have gotten in. And, you know, in terms of the bowling, you know, we've got to find ways to get, to limit the scoring, obviously, but I feel the best way to do that is by taking wickets. No, I was really happy with the way O'Shea bowled. You know, I, I, love, I love his liveliness, you know, he's quicker than you think you know he's very very quick and you know he had to express himself you know I just feel the situation for him to come as hard as he possibly could in terms of trying to get wickets um, yes he got us the, the early breakthrough and I try to use him in short bursts to be impactful you know sometimes it goes for you sometimes it goes against you just today one of those days where two quality players took the game away from us yeah Hetty was quite a, quite aggressive you know um, fortunate for us it, it worked out and you know it was really good to see him get as deep as he, as he could. Unfortunately, when he, uh, at the stage he got out, you know, I felt as though he could have gone a little, a little further, you know. But you know, it's a game where you think with a team like India, you, you're never quite sure, you know, what's a par score. Um, in hindsight, as you said, 320 was probably a par score, and we needed to kick on a little further. Uh, having said that, I was really pleased to at least get 300 because we've been at fault in the past for not getting up to 300, for maybe not buying out the allotted overs as well. So I was really pleased to see the way the guys have played themselves. We were probably losing wickets at crucial stages, as you pointed out, but it's really good to see we batted all the overs and, and, and obviously we got past 300 runs, you know. So I still think a, there are a lot of positives. As I said, inexperience probably did show when we batted as well and bold. So it's just a matter for us, you know, to learn a little, learn quickly and, you know, hopefully correct one or two of um, the mistakes that we made today. Um, not really, you know. I think the pitch today was, was a pretty good one. Um, you know, a lot of balls skid, skidded off the turf. It wasn't much bounce. And it was probably hard to judge the pace of the wicket up front, you know, when you batted. Um, 
you know, in 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 these kind of in, in these kind of formats, you, you like a wicket taking bowler, and and we try to use Ocean in that form. And obviously, you, you obviously look to your wrist spinners in in limited overs cricket to obviously do the damage as well. And I felt Bishu didn't start as well as he as we would like, but I was really happy to see the way he finished. You know, to get the wicket there, Virat at that stage was was crucial, and it showed what 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 he can produce. You know, I just said to Bish in the spell, I figured as more he should be probably looking to spin it a little bit more as opposed to being a little bit more flat and you know it, it worked out for him in his second spell so I was really happy the way he bowled.